Welcome back friends. Continuing to our previous video, in this video we will see how to monitor chat in an open fire server. So let's see how to do that. Now we are on a server and we have a two users in Active Directory. We have created a two users. Let me show you. This is Jack and Jack2. So we will log in with this user and we'll try to do some chat and we'll see how it gets monitored. So let me type the password for this and do a login. And another user is Jack2 and we'll also log in with this user. See the Jack is logged in and here I have added the account for Jack2 like you can just if you want to add the contact for the another user you can just click on contacts add and you can type the five letters like if you want Jack2 and click on check names and it will find the name and you can do the add contact it's already added so I'm not going to add it so let's see how we can see this chat recording let me open the admin console and we'll log in with the administrator account that is a Jack is our administrator here and you can go to the plugins we have to install a monitoring plugin for this and you can go to the plugins and you can see the available plugins available plugin and you have to go to the monitoring plugin because um, it will show you here right now it's not uh, showing here because it's already installed on this uh, machine so you will see the monitor plugin here and you can just you have to click on add and once it is added that means you will see the plugin here like this pl this plugin is monitoring service and it is installed and you will find it like this so if you want to uh, see how uh, users are chatting with each other you can just go to the server and if you want to see the statistics you can see the two users currently the two users are logging active conversation is one packet permanent is 44 packets have been sent and the user the two users the active chat for the, these two users is jack, jack and jack2 and the messages are 15 but what are those messages which these users have been sent to each other you can go to the archiving and you can see uh, the participants either you can type the name Jack and Jack2 and you can select the date range on which uh, date you want to select let me do it with one okay let me do it for today and even you can uh, select the keyword you can type the keyword uh, for that chat and it will search for it let's see if it brings some I think it is not bringing the current chat it it does take some time for uh, to appear here uh, but to my previous chat you can see here I have a previous chat here like what they type like Jack type hi hello and Jack two responses with this message so this is a way like you can uh, check uh, the chat between two users.